Welcome back to my channel guys, Tara Gay Nicole here. And if you're new, welcome. If you like what I do on this channel, please go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. So today, I have a wig unboxing for you. I actually got the same wig in two colors because one is a more out there color and one more is a more wearable color. I'm hoping I've never got either of these colors in this specific wig. So I'm excited to do that. I actually saw reviews on this wig from hearts and cakes 90 i believe and also girl rates world if you don't know about them and you like wigs and wig unboxes and things like that please go ahead and check them out they do reviews on wigs and unboxing on wigs and um they they tell you the truth they give you their information how they like it so i'll make sure i link information cards up in the corner for their channels as well and if i can find the video for the specific wig for their review i will also um link that in the description box now let's get into it because i don't want it to be long that's why i'm going to do one wig on each, a different video for each wig so let's start off today with the more of the just normal looking wig i got both of these wigs from sisterwig.com and this is the box that they came in that's what they came in and they came with basically just your information which paid and all of that and then both of the wigs in the box and they also sent me a expandable stocking wig cap which is nice that's why my hair is out because I'm gonna just use their wig cap they sent it in um, color 2225 BLA which I assume is just a black which is thanks thank you so much sister wig I appreciate that the shipping on this wig was pretty normal about four to five business days I believe I ordered it I want to say maybe on a Saturday on a Sunday or a Sunday and I had it on Friday. So about a week. So I'm not, I don't, stocking cap, very regular stocking cap, but that was really nice. They didn't have to send me a stocking cap. Most people don't. Oh, it's two of them. That's nice. One for each wig. So let me just get my hair back up under here. It's the only good thing about having my hair pressed I don't have to like braid it up to put under a wig you guys should know I have like butter fingers I drop everything okay <laughs> that's not that big I probably should have wrapped this we gonna see being lazy today guys I'm sorry sorry all right ready and if you do like this makeup look, I did a very long video, I'm sorry, using all of these new products that I got. And this was using the Roses CoverGirl True Match uh, palette, I believe is the name of it. So, the name of the wig that we're going to get today, going to be looking at today, is the Free Trust Equal Lace Deep Invisible L Part Wig in Carissa. And this wig has been on the YT lately, at least I've just noticed it on the YT like right around Valentine's Day and everybody that I've seen review it has done a very nice job. It looks pretty on everybody. So I was like, must be all right then. So I'm gonna give it a try. Um, this wig is curling iron safe up to 400 degrees. I don't usually curl mine and the color that I have it in is OH227144. I have not really seen anybody else do this color. So I'm excited to try this out. And this is also a new color for me. This wig usually comes in like 1, 1B, 2, 4, OP27, OP430, OP99J, and a few others. OT Purple and Haze Purple. So this is what the packaging looks like pretty much, your standard packaging. And again, I have an OH227144. I will list the name of the wig, the link to the wig, and the color that I got down in the description box. Just going to take her out. Oh, she's not stapled in. Most of them usually are stapled in. Um, and, ooh, I'm a little afraid of this color because I've never had a wig in this color. Take the netting off. As I fling probably the silicone pack over there. But I don't have any kids, so it'll be fine. Or dogs or pets. And this is a care card, which I'm going to just snip off. Or pull off, because I can't see my scissor anywhere so
okay so this is a lace front wig and these are the colors i hope you guys can see it it is very pretty it's a lot of browns and stuff which i'm not used to as y'all know i get reds on dx425 or the fire red or a one so browns are going to be different for me i do like that the root is dark and speaking of the root the parting looks pretty good so I don't think I'm going to have to pluck that. I'll decide on plugging that later, but I'm not going to plug it for the video. I think it's fine. These curls are gorgeous. And I have not gotten weight. I'm getting a little bit of shedding, actually. I am getting some shedding, and I haven't cut the part yet. So I don't know how good that is. I mean, not the part. I haven't cut the lace off yet. So I'm going to say this, this wig is probably one that is going to shed. So, but the, the look at it. Let me just shake it out a little bit. It looks good. So I'm going to say it is going to be a shedder. And it's a long wig. So I'm going to assume that it probably is going to tangle as well. But she is gorgeous. So I'm going to go ahead and cut the lace off of this wig. And I'm going to put some concealer. Not concealer. I'm going to put some powder. My Fit Me powder in the part. And I'll be back. Oh, hey guys. So this I put the Maybelline Fit Me powder in the part. It's a pretty long part. It is an L part wig, so it goes all the way out, but just by adding the powder, the part looks so much more realistic. And um, this is what the hairline is looking like, and I'll show you guys again when it is on my head. It's a really nice, pretty nice hairline because it doesn't go straight across. You get a few dips in it, which is nice. Oh no, I lied. It goes pretty straight down. It goes pretty straight down. But let's put it on. But I'm really liking the color. I'm hoping it looks nice on me. But I'm sorry. I have issues with my sinuses and whatnot. So if you hear me doing that, I know it's probably a little annoying. I'm sorry. Oh, wait. Sorry. <laughs> I'm all out of place today. I'm not really very well. There is a comb in the back. Right there. There's adjustable straps. And I just realized this because I was looking for them on the sides. There are no comb on the sides, but there are combs by if you wanted to open up that L part, you can open up the L part and your combs will be right there so you can stick into that part there. So now let's put it back on. There's like a hump at the top of this wig, I think, though. Um, this color, though. This color, though. <laughs> Can y'all see this? Are y'all seeing this gorgeousness? This hair, if you don't like full hair, this is not for you. This hair is super full, and this bang is everything, because it just drops so nicely where it needs to drop you don't have and it's staying there you don't have to keep moving look at all this hair oh my gosh look they look like a hump here <laughs> i don't know i don't know if that's because it's not braided down but i feel like it's just a natural hump in the wig you might want to use your curler to put that down or something or just a lot of hair on this unit so it's doing that oh my gosh you guys i don't even I don't even usually like browns on me, but the combination is gorgeous. This hump is truly bothering me, but <laughs> it's truly bothering me. Um, but other than that, I'm not even looking at y'all. I'm so looking at me. It's so bad. This, this wig makes you feel like freaking Beyonce. This and it's hot. It's hot. <laughs> I don't think this is a summer wig unless you're going to be somewhere with some AC. I'm trying to put all the hair to the front. This is all the hair to the front. And y'all just disregard that because I don't know. I'm going to have to work on that. Because all my hair is back hair. So I don't know why there's a hump there. There's, that's a little annoying. But other than that, do you see this? This hair is beautiful. This is so nice. This is like a better version, a bigger version of like vanity. 
yeah. Okay, so let me, yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. <laughs> what y'all think? Leave me a comment down if y'all like it. I'm so excited about the other color now. This is so freaking pretty. But, okay, so, yeah, I'm about to. I disappeared on y'all. I'm sorry, I disappeared on y'all. But I'm about to get a pen. Actually, I'm not going to do that right now. Well, I'm going to get a pen and, like, try to find that hump and just kind of find a track and pin it down because it's getting on my nerves. And y'all ain't seeing the fullness there of this beautiful, gorgeous way. Really? Yes, a little better. But, okay. So, anyway, this is what it looks like in the front. This is what it looks like from the side. I hope y'all are seeing all of it. It's pretty long. Oh my God, it's really long. I doubt y'all can see it all. It's like right above my butt. It's really, really long. Like really long. And then this is what the back looks like. I should have put on some heels to show you this. It's so much hair. It's a lot of hair, y'all, though. So much hair. This is what the other side looks like. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This hair is gorgeous. I don't have anything that I have to say about this hair. Except I think it's going to shed. Not on my clothes yet. But don't play with it a lot. Don't play with it a lot. That hump is a little annoying. But I'm sure we can figure out something to do to fix that. And the color is gorgeous. Like, I don't have anything like this color. I don't think it's really pretty. I really like it. I really like it. It's turn me on to a new color. I'm always like, anything with like brown and blondes, I just don't think will look nice on my skin tone. But I was wrong. Yeah, pretty much. But uh, yeah, okay, let's see if I can change this to a middle part. Take that pin out. See what the middle part is looking like. Oh. I don't know if this is gonna, gonna let's see. I see anything. I was gonna say, I don't know if it's gonna look good as a middle part, but I don't know. But this wig, it just it don't look like it's in the middle. Okay, well, I'll hump right there for really. <laughs> okay, 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 okay for the middle part. Okay. That hump. <laughs> but other than that, it looks really nice in the middle part. Also, guys, oh my goodness. Don't let them fool you. Now, the part is a little L, so it does, you know, go back a little like that. But if you don't fill in all the powder, you can stop it there. Yes, this is really pretty. I'm feeling real Farrah Fawcett right now. Yeah, Beyonce on deck. I love it. It looks good as a side part. It looks good as a middle part. It is no lacking of hair. It is a little more expensive than the ones I buy. But this is not more than like 31 bucks, 32 bucks. It's gorgeous. Y'all see it. I don't mind this model for y'all for a minute. No, let me stop playing. But I really love this wig. <laughs> I really love this wig. And then, of course, when you take your time to take your baby hairs out and make it blend with your hair. <laughs> Don't tell me nothing. But anyway, that's it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Stay tuned for the other color. It's going to be something a little more out of the ordinary than this one. And I hope you guys like it. For my girls who like color coming at you, here comes another one. Be on the lookout for that. Remember, in order to be great, you have to be grateful. Remember to leave some comments. Subscribe if you like it. Peace, loves.